What what a raft? Oh, I'm going to level one step right here, right here y'all. <laughs> Hey y'all and happy Sunday. It's your girl P Hope. And um I am out and about once again. Oh y'all, I'm just been I hate having to rush when I get out the shower because it seemed like it'll take me forever to stop sweating. I'ma put some um lip gloss on my ashy lips, but not right now because um I need to do, I need to prep one more thing before I put anything on my lips. But anyway, anywho, today is a little different. Um, I am looking real pregnant off up in the face. But despite that, um, I'm going tubing today, y'all. Me and the gang are getting ready to go water tubing. And, and I will vlog as much of it as I possibly can. So, Get ready, cause here we go. River tubing with the gang gang. <laughs> hey little giants. <laughs> hey little giants. <laughs> hey little giants. <laughs> Oh, it's hot. Hey, little giants. Excuse me. <laughs> yes, too big. Too big. Go and put that, put that on down for you, too. Get it on down. Get it on down for the two. Put it on the two. Brittany, your dog is a thug. I don't think they're gonna allow your dog out here. Don't say that. I thought I was not gonna be able to vlog, but the water is so calm, y'all, that I was able to get on out here. Let me show y'all the group because it's not just me out here. Me and baby is not the only two out here. Hold on, one This is the crew. <laughs> Y'all already know who my rider is beside me, my passenger, Sabrina. Then we got Cousin over there. Then we got Sheena. Then we got Kimmy. You got Keith Sweat back there somewhere. Keith Sweat? <laughs> you here back there because you got her twisted. Oh, that's what we don't have. Okay. And y'all not gonna pay no attention to these tree branches in everybody's hand. Don't pay no attention to that. This is a kid-friendly channel. Why, 
Jamaica. Adrian. Adrian. Ryan. Adrian. Cause you just the water sound do something to you. Balancing her chakras. Yeah. All right. Whatever Erica right. Badu be doing to them niggas, same shit. <laughs> That's a fucking shame. <laughs> Just laid out. Look who but look who but Cole. <laughs> I feel like I've been out here for three days. I got my feet all on and. I'm trying to get out it's only been about two hours. So we still got about another two hours to get down to here. Three hours later. I have arrived back at home. <laughs> I just wanted to go ahead and finish telling y'all how my tubing experience went. I know I was trying to explain what I, what little bit I could while I was out there on the water. But um, I know it could be some people that's really curious like I was to know how it is so the location that we was at was the um I think it's called the tube and ride I could have that name wrong I will put it somewhere up here so y'all will know the correct name of it but I think it was called the tube and ride and it's located in Duluth Georgia and you ride down the Chattahoochee River it was a four hour float and um they provide the you can well they don't provide it but you can rent you can rent the tubes from them you can rent the um extenders because it was nine of us so um everybody wanted to stay attached to each other so um we had we um purchased the extenders for those and we also purchased an extra float to put our um coolers and all our bags on so um, everything worked out fine. We had a lot of food, a lot of snacks, a lot of drinks. Um, things that I would advise you not to forget to take with you. Um, if you're like me and you don't want to do a whole lot of sun, bring you an umbrella or a really big shaded hat. Something that's going to keep you out of the sun and bring some sunglasses um next time i'm gonna definitely go ahead and just do a full umbrella i had on a visor but uh, it was not doing it the visor was not doing it so um i would say bring a umbra a small umbrella to um to block the sun when it starts to get too too hot you definitely want to pack a dry towel um a speaker you know that's a it's a long little float so you got to have something to entertain yourself you don't just want to be out there playing on your cell phone and then of course you're going to be talking to whoever you out there with but definitely bring some type of um waterproof speaker so that you guys can have music or play games or whatever it is that you want to do while you're out there because i mean you got four hours on your hands so you got to have something to do um if you have any waterproof card games or trivia games that you want to think of i think that's a good idea i think i already touched on this but i'll go ahead and be extremely elaborate um that tubing is a big girl friendly um a big girl friendly adventure that you can do big girl big boy um i am a 300 plus pound woman and i am also currently seven months pregnant and everything from the beginning to the end was absolutely fine for me i thought i was going to struggle trying to get in the tube i thought i was going to struggle trying to get out of the tube but i actually honestly y'all i didn't have trouble doing either one um the way that they have the ramp set up for you to get in the water um it's extremely easy it's nothing embarrassing about it and the way that they have it set up for you to get out of the water is also set up the same way it's, it's not um gonna put you in a predicament where you look like a whale out of water so <laughs> um so yeah i would definitely go tubing again even while i'm pregnant but i just know the things now that i need to 
pack extra and things and extra rentals that um, need to be purchased so yeah the overall experience was really really fun I enjoyed each and every person that went if tubing is something you've never done before I would definitely give it a thumbs up and say that you try it and take your friends and your family with you and you can even take your children I think um, they say as long as the children are five and older um, they can also be out there on the water with you there were some people that had their dogs out there now this one man had um, it was a big it was a big dog but you could tell that the dog was a puppy I think it was like one of those Beethoven type of dogs but um, he was really really scared so you know if you don't think that your dog enjoys water or something like that then I would say leave your pets at home but if you know if your pet is adventurous like you are and you know you you think that he or she would enjoy it then they do allow you to bring your dogs um out there on the tube and too so that's just it. that that should let y'all know how calm the water is they let small children and animals go out on the water and majority of the um the four hour ride will float whatever you want to call it the water is very very shallow so um yeah you don't have to worry about getting caught out in this deep titanic type of water it's um uh, it, there's a lot of different areas of the water where you can actually get out and stand up and walk around if you want to that's what if, if you choose to do i would need to be way more comfortable <laughs> with getting in and out of the tube and um you know just way more comfortable with myself in general before i do anything like that but um I'm just trying to give y'all the full details on just how easygoing um, tubing really, really is if you're going to the Chattahoochee River, if you're going to the Duluth location, then, you know, everything is easy peasy. If you have any more questions pertaining um, going, then just drop down in the comment section below and I'll be glad to answer any questions that um, I have the answers to. <laughs> <laughs> and other than that, you already know I want you to be healthy, be happy, be safe. This is your girl P Hope. I'm tired. I'm about to take a shower. The water and the sun have kicked my butt. I look a hot mess, but I will catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.